Hey, this is Margaret Lynch, creator of the Tapping and 12 Coach Training Program, and oh my God, I have so much to say, and people are going to be mad at me afterward. I'm going to get some negative um, comments. Okay, so I've been talking a lot about transformational coaching, and of course, that's the kind of coaching skills that I bring to people through the different programs that I have. Um, however, you should never, ever say to somebody, oh, I'm a transformational coach. You would never, ever want to lead with that. That's the last thing that you would want to do because here's the thing. Transformational coaches, the way I train people is that we solve urgent, expensive, painful problems and we know how to speak to those problems in a way that captivates people. So they come to us going, Wow, what you said, I can't live without. You just described all my pain and all my problems. And so in a lot of different coaching techniques and coaching programs, you finish the program and then you start to describe yourself as a coach with that skill. And now you're in a conversation discussing the technique or what it is, because no one's ever heard of it. And um, we call that like leading with your modality, right? Or the modality myth, thinking that talking about you, the kind of cool coaching that you have or the modality that you're using is going to get people involved. Now, maybe one out of a room full is going to be kind of woo-woo and they're going to be like, wow, that sounds really cool. And then they're going to say those next few words, which is a trap that is going to bring you down along the wrong direction. They're going to say, I would like to try that and what's the problem with that? It leads to a freebie or a demo session or one session. And then at the end of that session, they say, that was really cool. And that is never, ever the way you want to start <laughs> anything you do as a transformational coach. And so you never walk around saying, I'm a transformational coach. That is what you know, your skill base, you know how to do. But you need to be able to talk to everyday, regular people that are walking around towns that will want to hire you because they will see you as someone that is incredibly expert and skilled and can pro solve the problems that they have because when you speak, that's what they hear coming out of your mouth. So super, super important. And it relates directly to the difference between learning a skill um, and having exuberant, enthusiastic, bubbling confidence in what you can do. And that's the other difference with transformational coaching is that when you become a transformational coach and you know how to have these deeper skills, you know how to uncover and get to the roots, you know how to use tools that make real measurable change in people both in the session and in their life, you start wowing people, right? And so when you have the skills that you know, wow, this really rocks, and then you start practicing and wowing people and they say to you, oh my God, that was amazing. You're so good at this. You're so brilliant. You're a genius. That creates a level of feedback loop of confidence that makes it really, really fun to be you, really, really fun to do what you do. And imagine what happens when you now show up at networking and you have that level of bubbling inner knowing because you've done it and it's been validated over and over by people you've worked with like, wow, you really rock. That's a whole different energy and it's very different than learning a skill. You have to um, step into a process that ensures that you get that kind of bubbling, enthusiastic confidence because it's different than just learning something new and then moving on to another program, right? It's different than learning something and then um, trying to bring it to people or doing freebies or demos and sort of actually not having your confidence built or have people say that was nice, right? We need the bigger results and the bigger reactions. And that is the same thing that comes all the way back around and is what you then have in your pocket when you are not describing yourself as a transformational coach. You're actually speaking to people about the real results that you can bring them, the transformation that you can bring to the very problems that they're solving with. And you come to that with a knowing, with an inner confidence, because you had the experience, you have wowed people, they have written you notes and emails and texts and told you, you've changed my life. And that carries with you from the very first conversation, knowing what to say to captivate people, to in the session work, 
and to even the sales conversation when you're offering somebody a package to sign up for a package to work with you. And so this is where knowing how to describe yourself very, very different when you're a transformational coach because transformational coaching does sound woo woo and the rest of the world, the broad majority of your client, potential clients may not be woo woo and know what that means. And secondly, because the amount of confidence and enthusiastic confidence and inner knowing that you can really blow somebody away brings a whole different element to transformational coaching in the way that you speak, the way you interact with people, the way you run your sessions, and the way that you create your packages because you know the results you can get. So I hope that makes sense. Um, I know it's very shocking to say never call yourself a transformational coach. I mean, you can tell me and we can talk about it, but your clients don't need to start off knowing that you're a transformational coach. You can just say, I have this deeper skill set. We work quickly, we work holistically, we work with the mind body. I just have these skills. <laughs> you don't need to get into all of the things that we call ourselves inside transformational coaching. This is Margaret Lynch, creator of the Tapping Into Wealth Coach training program, working on my training for you about the deeper details about transformational coaching. I've actually got five keys that make transformational coaching differently, and I'm going to be doing that in a couple weeks. Don't miss it. It's my last training, my last live training for a long time. I will be uh, teaching people in the event that, that people have purchased to get a certification in my deeper work, and I'll be in immersed in doing that. And I'm also speaking at ASAP, Association for Comprehensive Energy Psychology in May. Got a lot of stuff happening. Um, so this is my last live training. Make sure you catch that and I'll see you soon. Have a great weekend. Bye.